one. Need more force. If it don't work, get a bigger hammer. Oh my god. I can't believe I was just going to go for a drive in this car. Good thing the brakes are seized. We have a serious fucking bee problem right behind my head. See, there's the driver's seat. And there's my pain in the neck. Bastards. Well, I suppose there's other ways to do this, but I just love to hear the snap, crackle, pop. <laughs> Dem bees are fucking dead now. Looks like I gotta call in the cleanup crew. Oh no, not one more. You bastard. Not even a sign of when them where them fuckers were. Oh well. Better call my buddy for a full detail for retail cleanup, you know. There ain't nothing like a hot car to pick up a fast chick, I'm telling you. Mmm, bee burgers. Nothing like smoked glass for custom tinted windows. <laughs> now let's see if she still runs. Good thing my redneck gas can didn't blow up. Smells a little different. Looks a lot different. Like a champ! The front wheels aren't technically seized, but they're stopping us from moving. Reason being, all the rain we had this year, cast iron master cylinder, the piston is stuck halfway down, and it's holding brake pressure on. So that's going to be a pain in the ass to get that piston unstuck. Piece of shit. Well, at least it runs. You can't kill a Toyota, not even with fire, like Top Gear showed.
and they're unbolted. Brake tube still intact. And just like I predicted, I can see that the blue aluminum piston is stuck about a half inch down into the cylinder. Nothing wrong with the actuator. So I took some steel wall and smoothed around in there. It's still stuck down, now I'll squirt some oil in. Now to smear it all around. Oh, that feels good. Well, I hope it gets the job done. Now, hit it with a hammer a few times and hope the piston pops back. You never know. Well, the hammer didn't work too well, but when I got this screwdriver in there and pried it at an angle, like that, it brought my piston back up. Now I've got to work it back and forth to free up my front brakes. It was holding the brakes on all the time. All back together, let's see if it'll finally drive now. So, final take. See if this thing will drive now. See if the brakes really are off. automatic. Just gotta warm the wheels up and see which brakes are seized. Just a bit of driving. Come on. Turn off. There. So what you do? Go around and feel the rims. Back ones are cold. That's starting to get warm. Yeah, that one is too. So, a little bit of front brake seizage, but at least we're motoring. 